Hello everyone. So if you don't know me, my name is Cassie. I've been a groomer for 10 years. I own a grooming shop and a mobile van in New Jersey and I post weekly grooming videos on YouTube. Two subjects is, hey, what's up with this quarantine? Are you guys open? Are you allowed to work? And also is why didn't I post videos for three weeks? Let's start out with are you open? What happened? We are open. We are allowed to work. I'm only working at my store because my van is still getting some work and service done that we dropped off at the end of March. Okay, so here's, here's what it is. So March 21st comes along. It's a Saturday. Michelle and I are at the store and the governor says you have to close by 8 p.m. because you're non-essential. Great. So how long are we going to be closed for? We have no freaking idea. So my husband and I were talking when I got home from work and I was like, oh, I don't even know how long this is gonna be. So I contacted NewJersey.gov and I'm like, hey, what are we looking at here? And they said, well, we're hoping for the end of April and possibly mid-May that you would be allowed to go back to work. And I'm like, okay, so at least we have like a little time frame. So, we decided to bring my van in on the last week of March to go get some service done. Thinking that we had like, you know, a minimal of a month. We had no idea. So, April 16th comes along <laughs> and I get a phone call and I get a message saying, hey, you're allowed to do mobile grooming. And I'm like, uh, I can't. My van's in the shop, it's getting serviced, it's ripped apart. I can't, I, I can't run my mobile. I'm freaking out. So I called them, I called up my father-in-law and I was like, hey, change of plans. We have to change everything that we're doing because we were gonna do this whole big heat exchange and he was off work and oh. So my father-in-law was like, I need another like week and a half. And I'm like, that's fine, just take it because if they open up my shop, I'm just gonna take everyone you know, at the shop. At least we can, do that. Trust me, I understand. I was not even aware of this information. So on Monday, April 20th, um, I was doing some videos, which I'm not going to tell you about. And I was like, okay, well, I'll do the last snip um, today. And then on Tuesday, I'll start editing it. And Monday night, April 20th, I get a phone call that my father just had a heart attack. And I was like, <sighs> we got in the car, rushed to my parents' house. It's like 1230 at night. And it, it just, and um, yeah, my father and I were very close. And he had a great life. And, you know, they, they, they pronounced him right before midnight. And um, that, <laughs> That was, that was a difficult day. So I had to put everything on hold. Phone calls, the store, my business, my videos, everything. I had to put it on hold so I could be with my family. We can handle some things. <sighs> um. Um, so I just needed a couple seconds. <sighs> Sorry. So about four days later, my groomer called me and said, Hey, um, I think that they're going to open up, uh, grooming salons. And I'm like, what? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm not ready. Uh-uh. Emotionally and physically, I'm not ready. I, I've got so much to do. And Michelle looked at me and goes, I'll take care of it. Don't worry about it. You know? I understand and she did she kicked ass so whatever that Monday was when it was like the last week of April or something that's when we were allowed to be open I'm driving right now so I'm, I'm not gonna look at anything so Emmy's been helping and aaron has been doing phone calls like crazy and Christine is helping with washing and bathing and oh my god it's been chaos. So yes, we are allowed to be open, but I needed to take some time and that was like three weeks because I had a lot to do. And being there for my family is the first priority. 
and videos can come later. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upload two grooming videos this week because I want to and I like grooming, I like videos, I love editing, I love the whole process. This is, this is my hobby, this is my life, this is my career and I love it. And I wanna thank you guys for being patient and waiting for me during this time of quarantine, my family and not being able to be open. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna bid you guys farewell and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.